Hey everybody, welcome back to 90 and Out. I'm your host, Timothy Holt, and this channel is all about the public reading and understanding of the Christian Bible. So don't take my word for it, pick it up, read it for yourself. Right now, we're involved in a series concerning Jesus of Nazareth and his parables. Parable is a word picture, a story with a spiritual or fundamental message. So what is the message behind the story. Today's parable is about the dragnet, and it takes place in Matthew chapter 13, starting in the 47th verse. So please give a thumbs up if you like this channel. Uh, subscribe, hit that bell. You'll get notifications every time I upload a new video. And let's dive in to these writings together. Without further ado, Jesus of Nazareth speaking here. Again, the kingdom of heaven is like a dragnet that was cast into the sea and gathered some of every kind, which when it was full, they drew to the shore. And they sat down and gathered the good into vessels, but threw away the bad. So it is, so it will be at the end of the age. The angels will come forth, separating the wicked from among the just, and cast them into the furnace of fire. There will be wailing and gnashing of teeth. So, what's he talking about here? Well, first I had to find out what a dragnet was. So I went to Good Search, uh, and found out a dragnet can be a uh, series of communications and uh, avenues on apprehending criminals. I don't think that's what it's talking about here. Um, it can also be a net that's thrown on the ground and dragged along the ground, catch small game like rabbits, squirrels, um, and the like. Again, not really the right uh, context here. Um, the third definition is a net that fishermen use, and they throw it into the sea, which was common in the Middle East, especially around the Dead Sea and in Nazareth. And they would throw it in, and then they would drag it behind their boat and gather up all the fish, every kind of fish, everything, turtles, whatever, in the net. And then when they got to the shore, they would separate out their daily catch. If it wasn't what they were wanting, they would throw it back into the sea. If it was, they would put it into vessels, they would clean it, they would um, preserve it with salt and things of that nature, which is pretty fascinating. But if they didn't want it, if it wasn't what they were wanting and looking for, they threw it away. And Jesus is saying that's what the angels are going to do at the time of judgment. They're going to come. They're going to gather up everyone, whether you believe or not, whether you are a follower of Jesus Christ and a disciple of his or not. If you're not, you're going to get destroyed. If you are, you're going to enter into paradise. That's it. That's the long end of the very short stick of reality. So I hope you got something out of this. May God richly bless you. Don't take my word for it. Pick it up. Read it for yourself. And as always, check out the rest of the content on this episode, on this channel. If you've uh, got a different interpretation here, please leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Don't take my word for it. Pick it up. Read it for yourself.